Introducing Prezi 2014, an exciting alternative to PowerPoint. My name is John, and I want to take you down a path of exciting presentation alternatives. With Prezi, your ideas become one large canvas where you can take a journey along with your audience. So instead of doing this, where you're forced to fit your presentation into a straight sequence of slides, you could be doing something more like this. Prezi is free, and it's easy to use. Just pick one of the many exciting templates to start with, and away you go. Plus, you create all Prezi's online, so you're always using the latest version of Prezi. Just click and go. It's that easy. So what are you waiting for? Why not give Prezi a try? and stand out from the rest. You'll be glad you did. Go with me through this Prezi and I will explain to you some of the finer points of how Prezi is different than PowerPoint. It's really just about thinking like Prezi versus how to think like PowerPoint. So I'm gonna dialogue with you as we go through this. Don't worry for now how I made this presentation or how I'm presenting it. We'll cover all of that in the later lessons. but. But here we go, how to think like a Prezi. PowerPoint forces us to think in linear slide-by-slide -slide format. So let's say we have a simple PowerPoint slideshow here. If you're gonna present using the PowerPoint Azure tool, you're forced to think in a linear fashion. So we've got slide one, and then you have your points you're saying on slide one, and then we have slide two, and you say some points about slide two, and then slide three, etc. So everything's in a sequential fashion. Now, I'm not knocking this, and I'm not knocking PowerPoint. It's a great tool, and I still use it all the time. But sometimes you may have ideas that kind of cluster into groups, and rather than putting them in a sequential slide like this, you can kind of cluster your ideas into different areas. Now, let's take a look at how Prezi deals with your different ideas and how to put them together on a Prezi slideshow. So watch as I go to the next slide here. It's going to kind of zoom over and up to here. So Prezi is more like one big canvas. You control the movement of the camera lens as it moves from one idea to the next. So you saw how I did that, just kind of zooming out and I zoom over to here and now you can see the next idea. Now watch what happens in my next movement. I'm gonna zoom right into a tiny point inside the circle that you can't even see right now. So here we go. So you can zoom in here. So see how I did that? If I go back a step, you can see that that next point isn't even visible right now but with my camera lens, and this is all on one big canvas, but I'm going to almost like a little fleck on the canvas to, so, to show you my next point. So you can see, and I come in like this, you zoom into here, and it's a very dramatic effect. Okay, so watch what happens in my next point. So I'm gonna zoom back out, and I'm gonna zoom over to here. Now, with your camera, as you move around the canvas, you can even tilt it to the side. So watch what I do next. Go sideways, so even rotate like this. So you see how I went from here, and I rotate and I come over to here. Now, talking about clustering your ideas, the next sequence I'm gonna show you is a good example of how you can take, say, three or four or five ideas, and if they're part of a main theme or a main concept, you can put them together in a group. So take a look at this next illustration. So I've taken a template right out of the Prezi uh, library, and I've used it here as a kind of a funnel. So here's a cluster of three ideas, and then I can zoom in on each one. So instead of going in a line, why not go down a funnel? It's much more fun. Okay, so that's a way that you can group your ideas together. That's very different. Like you can't really do that kind of thing in PowerPoint. So I'm gonna zoom down here. So when you're done, why not pull back out to see the whole canvas view again? Here we go. Now when I go to show you the next view, the entire thing that I've just gone through with you is gonna be shown on one screen. So now you're gonna get a chance to see the entire canvas. And here we go. And that's it, that's the entire presentation. Everything that I've just shown you is contained in this big outer uh, set of brackets. And you know, we just kind of zoom back and forth. I can go backwards through this as well and you can see how it just kind of goes in reverse order here. Okay, but this whole time that I was talking with you with this presentation, we were basically inside this entire bracket. Okay, and, and basically that's all there is to the essential part of Prezi. You're given a big canvas, you can control the fonts and the colors and the shapes in the order that you zoom your camera in, and you basically just travel from one thing to the next. 
So in our first lesson, we're going to use Prezi's template to create our, our very first presentation. And you'll see how quickly and easy it is to put all of that together.